working for you guys on defense right now? I mean, if you look at the numbers, the last two games holding teams at 30%. Well, just communication, activity, um, just uh, understanding where we need to be uh, when certain situations come up. Um, and uh, testing shots, just being active, just uh, continually continuously working, I guess. You, you mentioned activity twice in, in there. How much does that, I guess, pay off in offsetting just what you guys don't quite know yet or each other? And It really pays it. off just to not stop and just continue to play and, and continue to hustle. Uh, so... Um, so if you continue to play, continue to move, you know, you might get a loose ball, you might you might late contest a shot, you might get a good box out, you might get a deflection. Um, so uh, th- little things like that make a big difference. So that's what we continue to, to focus on and, and not stop playing and, um, and just cover for each other, communicate. You know, basic things that are, that are important to our team and we wanted to make sure we continue to do. Even with all the newcomers coming in and you know there being a new system war, how much of the fact that it seems like every player has a clearly defined a role in the team make that easier in terms of? I don't think the, the, the roles are getting clearer and clearer out there. Um, so uh, I think everybody understands you know what we're trying to do, and, um, and you know, we've, we've been working hard and we understand that we face a, a few challenges here and there. Uh, but um, you know right now things. Are, we played two, two pretty good games, two good wins, and uh, we want to continue to do that. Uh, we know, you know the schedule is going to be crazy, but uh, we'll take it one game at a time. What was it like to see the bench score 15 of the 19 points in the fourth quarter, Blake hitting threes, you know, Barnes hitting threes? Guys it's, always, it's always important when everybody contributes, in and, 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 uh, especially when you got guys coming to the bench that they know they're going to have significant minutes uh, just being productive and being effective and, and taking shooting with confidence and rhythm uh, just by moving the ball and, and making the right play. In fact, you can count on those guys in key key situations? Yeah, absolutely. I think that, you know, key situations are going to come up, so we're going to have plenty of chances to, uh, to prove ourselves there. Um, so we're just trying to grow uh, at this particular point. We're just trying to be a better team and, and, and um, you know, just get everything right. How much does it help you guys just to be further away from some of the madness that was going on you know, right when training camp opened and there was that uh, uncertainty? I think a lot. I think when uh, there's less distractions outside, and, uh, it's easier to focus. So it helps when things are a little calmer. Looking forward, uh, I know we've asked before, but uh, Drew. That's, yeah, that's, of course. Of course. Ah. Yeah, Drew is a, is a great player, a uh, pretty inside player for us. So he, he can help us in, in different ways. So, um, you know, we look forward to having him back in the lineup. And, um, you know, the bottom, the bottom line is, you know, he can, he can, like I said, do a lot of things. And um, it'll give us a deeper, deeper rotation inside. And, um, so it's just a matter of, of, of staying healthy. You know? how, how much does it change for you positionally in terms of sliding a, the floor? A little, a little, uh, a little but, uh, but you know, I don't know if, if, uh, how much the rotation will change. Right. If, if it'll be a three-man or four-man rotation or um, how much minutes will vary. Um, so, so we'll see. But uh, we look forward to having him back. Uh, obviously, I uh, had really good... Uh, Preseason games, uh, he's in good shape. He's, uh, he's ready to go. Obviously, missing these four games is it's not something fun for anybody, and uh, so he's uh, he's ready to go. Just being Kobe's teammates, uh, <laughs> being Kobe's teammate, what have you noticed this season as far as things that he's been able to do a lot easier than maybe past few seasons? It's just you know, his health and all that. Oh, uh, he just continues to be himself. You know, he's loyal to. To his game, to his, uh, you know, what has made him so successful, and um, you know, and he's uh, buying into a new system. Uh, I think he's, uh, you know, uh, just understanding what it takes to for this team to to be a great team, and, and he's doing it so far.